Yo, it's your boy Coach Coffee with the first video on this channel. Just a heads up, if I call myself King Coffee, Coffee, Coach Coffee, Coffee APG, they're all Coffee AP me. Just so you know, yeah, every single one of those accounts are mine. So I go by any of those names. Or you can just call me Nate, Nathan, I don't care. <laughs> um, what is there to say about this? Well, I've decided to make this YouTube video or this YouTube channel to coach people on how to play games, uh, a more educational standpoint, but at the same time, I'll also be recording my gameplay and just banter with friends, having fun, that sort of stuff, you know? Um, so expect a wide range of things. Most of it will be Overwatch content because I am an Overwatch addict. However, I also play a lot of Warzone, I also play a lot of FIFA, I also play a lot of Cold War, and I want to get into coaching in terms of those few uh, games, and I also want to get into, uh, into, why can't I speak right now? Come on, I've been doing this YouTube thing for like six months now, um, I should be better at it, <laughs> but yeah, I also want to get into like Valorant, Fortnite coaching, stuff like that, but I guess we'll start small and we'll start... Um, if you don't know me, I'm a content creator on Instagram. I'm currently at 9.1k, maybe 9.2, I haven't checked. But, yeah, uh, so my Instagram growth is going kind of well. I am actually a coach for Overwatch, so I coach. I've been paid to coach, all of that sort of stuff. Um, I'm actually from console originally, 3.8k peak. Now I know what you're thinking, 3.8k isn't great. It's really good, but it's not great. My excuse there is I hit top 500, I hit top 200 on console. There's no motivation whatsoever to get any better on console. I was already performing in uh, console gaming league, CGL, stuff like that. I was doing tournaments, I was managing teams and nothing was really doing it for me. And now two months into my journey onto PC, I'm currently at 3.2k and every team that I've tried for and played for in terms of my actual playing has said that my game sense is incredible but my mechanics aren't incredible but that's that's because I'm new to the platform what can I say <laughs> um yeah other than that I've coached a 4k team I've managed a 4.2 plus team and now I'm coaching a 4.4k team called Team Concussion and it's going pretty well, yeah. Um, I have experience as a head coach, which is basically like team synergy, looking at over, uh, looking over team stuff. I'm happy to look at your team gameplay and your setups and how you guys should attack certain situations using different team comps and stuff like that. I'll be able to inform you, do VODs with you and stuff like that. If you want me to upload them, then I'll upload them onto YouTube. It's as simple as that. But what I'm best at what i prefer to do personally at a one-on-one -on -one vods assistant coach role where i look at your gameplay so i focus on you every little detail i'll replay it i'll replay it i'll replay it i'll let you know what you're doing wrong even if it's a little small thing like leaving spawn doors staying out of line of sight so you don't take extra poke it's stuff like that that low level or or let's not say low level because I've seen this happen in GM games, but the top, top players will be thinking about every single one of these things. And my job to you is just to get you thinking like a top level player. Um, yeah. Uh, in terms of my motivation for doing this, I love helping people. I love coaching. I love Overwatch. What can I say? I love video games. I will happily coach on COD because I actually do have experience being a COD coach as well, very briefly for an American team that I set up. It was uh, the AP Jags team. And if you don't follow them on Instagram, just look up AP Jaguars on Insta. Might even provide a link and you'll see we managed to get a fairly big page out of that now as well. Um, in the long term, See, I have two main loves in my life. One's acting and one's video games. I would love to do anything down any of those routes. And to be honest, I do try. I try very, very hard 
to succeed in the things that I am good at. So the dream would be to be a tier one coach. Like I would love to coach tier one. I would love to coach tier two, even contenders, seeing all the players that are really motivated and good enough to get into Overwatch League. But yeah, tier one coach, that's the goal. That's the goal for all of this coaching stuff. I want to be Overwatch League level. I want to be recognized. And uh, further down that line, I would like to do something big for esports, just something revolutionary, like, I don't know, making esports an Olympic sports or 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 even better having an esports olympics called the e olympics i'm copywriting that now if that's made this video is going to emerge and i will sue you i will sue the life out of you because i've come up with that term right it's been recorded what's the date today what's the date 8th of march 2021 e olympics that's gonna be my thing and we're gonna set that up together <laughs>